Here's one that's going around Facebook right now. I'm not on Facebook. My wife is on Facebook, and some of my folks here are on Facebook because it's their job, and some of them are on Facebook here because they want to be on Facebook. This guy is running this thing, and it's gone uh, quite viral. It looks like it's under Credit Karma, but I don't know if it really is or not. can't believe Credit Karma would actually do this. It's on their forums. Oh, okay. If your original creditor sold your debt to a collection agency, they also wrote off your debt on their taxes, which wrote off your obligation to pay. False. When you sell a debt to someone else, if you owe me $10,000 and I want to sell that $10,000 obligation to George, now you owe George $10,000. I, I did not write it off on my taxes. If I took a loss on it, I might have written that loss off on my taxes, but it does not relieve you from your obligation. Back to the bad crap on Facebook, like this is the only bad crap on Facebook. Uh, you can dispute the transaction via dispute at transunion.com, along with any other collection agency, owed items lingering on your credit report. Your dispute reason is contract was canceled. Well, the contract was not canceled, you doofus. And you can write no contract in the dispute con comments. There is a contract, doofus. I have cleared thousands off my own report and have been working to help my friends and family do the same for free. Peace and love to all knowledge is power. Well, it, knowledge is power if it's accurate, but you doofus, this is not accurate. You cannot just write contract canceled. If you could do that, you could just send your mortgage company a little letter that says contract canceled and you would no longer owe your mortgage. That's the dumbest butt thing I've ever heard in my life. Did you never even take a general business course, much less a B-law class of any kind? You people run around practicing what we call street law, which is stupid mythology, practicing law on Facebook need to stop. So here's the thing. Here's the scary thing. 205 people found this helpful. Of course, you have to rank everything on Facebook, right? It's not helpful. It's completely false. You cannot just write on a debt disputed, and it goes away magically. That's a bunch of crap. You still oh, you still signed a contract with MasterCard. You still went to the hospital and got the medical procedure done, so you still owe a medical bill. You just don't owe it at the hospital anymore because they didn't think they were going to get any money, so they sold it for pennies on the dollar to a debt buyer, but the debt buyer now owns your butt. Legally. So if you try this Facebook stupidity that's going around, expect to get sued into oblivion. This is what following stupid Facebook advice will get you. Expect to get sued into oblivion and lose. You cannot just write disputed on the thing and make it go away. It's like that scene in the office when he says, I declare bankruptcy. Like he declared bankruptcy out loud, and that made him bankrupt. No, you doofus, you have to go file bankruptcy papers. You can't just declare disputed, and it goes away because some idiot on Facebook said so. Hey, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest content and check out these other great clips from the show.